welcome to my new show. What a fantastic set Dibs has given me. Tonight we have some lovely guests, so I've been told, and some that you have met before? Okay, maybe that's not a good thing. But I'm sure we are going to have a great new show. So without any delay, let's bring on our first guest. All the way from the Netherlands, she's been here before. Please give a warm welcome to the clothes changing poker player we all know and love. Big G. Hello everyone. Oh, gosh. Gee, that sounded like English. We have a translator on standby, just in case that was a one-off. No, it is not a one-off. I have had lessons in English. Is that from a little boy? What do you mean? Well, you sound like a little boy, G. Why is it you always insult me? I have to, it's my job. I will walk off again if you keep it up. Oh, no, please stay. I am just glad I don't have to repeat all the time. What was that? I said I am glad I don't have to repeat all the time. Ha ha ha, got you. Well done, you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. No problem. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. That's all right. Thank you. No problem. Thanks. Right, let's move on. I like the new set, by the way. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. No problem. Thanks. Stop it for goodness sake. No problem. Are you going to interview me or not? Um, no. We have run out of time. Typical. Sorry. Just one question. Ask away. You still spamming Facebook with crap music? Yes, of course. It's my job. That's what little boys do, you know. Oh, go jump in a lake. Ladies and gentlemen, a big hand please for... Big G, sorry. Gilders. Now on to my next guest. He's new to the show, and a very special guest as he's a professional poker coach and runs the famous Blade Academy on Facebook. Yes, I thought that would prick up your ears. So let's hope we can pick up some tips. Please give a big Kirsty show welcome for the one and only, Blade. Hello Kirsty, so good to be on your show. Thank you Blade, so good you could make it. Just one thing, where is the hoodie? Oh, good question. Well, I was out in the field killing vampires and suddenly remembered about the show, No Time to Change, Honey. Killing Vampires? Oh my. I hope you have not met Tangent Ted. We love him, you know. Tangent Ted, come and tell me more. Maybe after the show. Anyway, I thought you took your name from Sheffield United Football Club. Not the film. God damn you, woman, you're good. And right, but it's my day off. I see. It's not often we meet a player as talented as you here on the show. Do you mind if I pick your brains? Pick away, darling. Oh, great. Let's say I am playing an Omaha game. I get Ace of Hearts. King of Hearts. Ace of Spades. And King of Spades. How much should I raise? Yes, a tricky one. I don't play Omaha. It's not my strong point. So I would fold. You would fold? Yes, only raise with two, three, seven jack. You will hit the nuts on the flop every time. Maybe Omaha is not your strong point then. Okay, Texas, no limit, hold em. I am on the button under the gun has mean raised, I hold ace ace. Do I go all in or re raise times four? I would fold your aces. Under the gun is three, three he will never fold and hit his three on the river. Interesting strategy. What would you raise with? Thoughts easy. Two, seven off, or ace six. Are you serious? Of course I am. I seen it on TV, mom. Blade. I thought you were a professional. Is there something wrong with my advice, honey? Um, yes, it's crap. How can you say my advice is crap? I've been playing for three months now and have already won a 10 cent sit and go. Oh my god. Another nutter. Why oh why is it always me? Get me some decent guests for feck's sake dibs. Okay, Blade. One last time to prove yourself. I am the best poker coach in the world. I taught Doyle Brunson how to play. He was six at the time. You are kidding me, right? No, it's true. Oh, Jesus. Him as well. Blade, please, for goodness sake. Dizera swears by you. And Tony Preston? A lot of people swear at me, especially at the bus stop. Okay, try this. I have cowboys on my big blind. Small blind raises times two? What do I do? If they're red, go all in. If they're both black, fold. 
What the feck? I only play red cards as thought's my favorite color. I really can't take any more of this bullshit. What would you do? Well, if I was you, I would give up poker and take up gardening. Hey, thought's a great idea. I never done gardening before. I am now a professional garden coach. Please look me up at the Blade Gardening Academy on Facebook. Right, get off my show, loser. Go on, piss off. No need to swear him off anyway. I got a plant pot to fill with mud. Please give it up for Blade. Well, I'm afraid we have run out of time on our new show. Next time I will be choosing my own guests, as Dibs only seems to pick nutters all the time. So stay safe and see you next time. Good night, all. <laughs>